How is it we got to this glorious moment we call grace? Well, it's simple. Started off with opposites. A whole series of opposites have made possible us sitting in this room with the unbelieving, unbelievable knowledge that there's another living in us that whether we as human beings live or die, come or go, that one living in us has vouchsafed eternity for us right now. Now, how did we get to this glorious moment? It's by the law of opposites. The first glimpse we have of God in the scriptures, chronologically, is his dealing with Lucifer. Now, probably the biggest failure that ever was, was Lucifer. Because he lived in the Father's house. He had the Father's inheritance. He ruled and reigned and had every single thing God could give to him in inheritance, and he failed. He was a miserable failure. He didn't take on God's nature. He didn't have God's spirit. But by the thing that Lucifer didn't do, you and I are able to do. Think about it now. Lucifer failed being right where God was, learning God. He failed. Now that's interesting, isn't it? He was right where God was, talked with him, walked with him, received from him, saw all of his power, knew everything about him, but learned nothing of himself that would please God. Never took on God's nature, never took on God's spirit, never took on God's burden, didn't care a thing about God. He was a taker. He was a getter. Miserable failure at that point. Now, some of you talk to the devil. Glad to hear Ted say that he didn't see the devil in it. That's good. But if you talk to the devil, be careful what you say. One good thing you can tell him is what a big failure he is. Because certain parts of religion and the world has him built up to where he's great and famous and powerful and he's running everything and he's dragging us all into hell and he's making us all sick and he's killing us. And I'm not going to deny that God couldn't use him in some of those areas, but when he comes around sometimes, just tell him what a failure he is. You fail. You could have been everything God is. You were there to get it. You had it. It was in your hands and you lost it. Your failure. But it had to have a failure to get us where we are now. 